Today I'm going to do another one of my spelling test videos, and these spelling tests have been uh, these spelling test videos have been uh, very popular um, so far. So I thought I'd do another one. And today, the theme of all the words are going to be Australian slang words that have a uh, positive meaning. So you know, words that mean excellent or great or good or beautiful, that sort of stuff. Okay, and now I've got to have my um, my assistant here. I'll call out the words, and my assistant will have a go at uh, spelling the words. Now, uh, okay, so there we go. And at the end of the video, uh, I'll mark the uh, words and see how my assistant went. Okay, the first word is ace. Ace is a word to, that's used to mean excellent or great. If something's ace, it's uh, very good. Okay, the next word is butte. So it's short, I guess, for beautiful. But uh, butte means, uh, you know, it's fabulous or it's great or it's good. More than being just beautiful. Okay, the third word is bonza. Okay, so bonza. Bonza is a word that uh, yeah, means great or something. Bonza. It's great or it's fabulous. It's bonza. Uh, okay, and now the uh, fourth word is ripper. If something is uh, good, you get some good news then, then that is a ripper. Uh, word number five, or it's more of a two words, I suppose. It, it's good on you. Now, good on you is sort of short for good on you. But, you know, the, the last two words are sort of run together to give you an on you. And if, you know, it's sort of like a slap on the back time, you've done a good job, well done, good for you, it's uh, good on you. Okay, the next word is grouse. Grouse, if something is great or good, then very good, it's grouse. Okay, word number seven is richy ditch. Richy ditch, if something is genuine or original. It's true, it's uh, said to be richy ditch. sort of associate with uh, surfies. Uh, you know, the waves are great. They're excited. And so they're stoked. Okay. Word lines. So two words. And this is she's apples. So uh, if everything's okay, all is well, then, then uh, we say she's apples. That's great, mate. Okay, 15. 
should really be spelt Y-O, yeah, but we spell it U, but if something is, um, yeah, it's good, it's, uh, you know, it's great, it's good condition, it's great, then uh, that's U, but something that you're proud of is U, but. Um, the bees and A's. So half your luck is uh, if you're, uh, you know, giving somebody congratulations, you know, pat on the back, best wishes, then you might say half your luck, you've got a good job, half your luck, you've won the lotto, half your luck. Okay, I think that's, uh, that's it now. So I'll put the uh, permanent marker to one side and let's go through the words and see if they're all spelt. Yeah. Um. 